So I just want to know how many of you guys opened this video thinking this is going to be awesome. A lot of you. And it is going to be awesome. Because there was a beta for this the GPS phone, GBA emulator for iPhone and iPod Touch, iPhone 3. Well, it's been ported to 2.0, 2.0.1, and 2.0.2, and so on, whatever Apple feels like releasing. Because so much has changed in the 2.0. And he's fixed a lot of stuff, the developer. He added multi touch for a lot of you people who want to press all the buttons at the same time, five plus buttons at the same time. Oh, that's nice. Um, you fixed, you know, when your screen gets laggy or whatever, or the game just stops, crashes, all that. Um, he improved, you know, everything's more fluid, like, and whatever, and whatnot. Everything works better. He used newer code, all that. Um, so you want me to stop talking about it and show you how to get it, right? Yeah. So take your iPod or iPhone or whatever you have, iPhone 3G, and install the changes. When you go into Cydia, you'll get um, changes. One essential upgrade, and just upgrade it and close Cydia. It'll restart and go back into Cydia, and for August 22nd, 2008, 708, whatever. Um, scroll down to the G's for that, right there. GPS phone from Zod TCD Games. So you install. GPS phone should be version 2.5.0 and the top corner right there press install so I'm going to install it it's 1.2 megabytes so it's pretty good not that big for an emulator you know like a keyboard is like 15 megabytes sometimes so return to city Fresh return to Cydia. And as soon as it's done loading, you don't need to do anything more in Cydia. So it's almost done. Uh, okay. Let's give it a home screen. Oh, come on. Oh, okay, okay. While you wait, um, if you didn't watch my other video about Doc, a really cool application. Right there at the bottom, there's a little yellow line. You know, that's dock, and it lets you switch your applications really quick. Okay. All right, so I'm back at the home screen. It's already done, and it's right there, right next to chip like GPS phone. So you open up GPS phone, and no ROMs were found right there. No ROMs. And that's because I do not have any ROMs. And if you do want to put ROMs on your GPS phone emulator, I'll make a video on it later. I'll show you how to SSH into your iPod and put the ROMs. And sooner or later, somebody should make a repo where you can just directly install ROMs onto your iPhone, or iPod Touch, whatever you have. Really don't care for the iPhone 3G, um, like the original more. Just saying. Um, so no ROMs were found. There is no repos for, you know, GPS phone, um, emulators or ROMs. Just you can install the emulator, but you'd have to put the ROMs on there through SSHing. And I'll make a video on how to SSH and put ROMs into your iPod or iPhone. But no, sor no sources, no anything. So, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment, rate. And one more thing, you guys are awesome because I have 20 videos and I have 21,000 views, which is kind of awkward, but it's really cool. Just started making videos, what, three weeks ago? A month ago? It's a pretty good start. Um, I'm hoping I can become a YouTube partner sometime tomorrow. Not really, but I am hoping I become a YouTube partner. Um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe.